Good morning. Hope everybody having a great day out there. Hope everybody is being positive and uh, moving with intent, getting to that bag. Yeah, I can't have this uh, crystal floating around in my face the whole time. It's my good old amethyst. Let's see if I can do something with that. Make it a little shorter. Yeah, that'll work. But yeah. I think my spirit guide's calling me to talk today about completing the task. You know what I'm saying? Getting the job done. And what I mean by this is like, take today for instance, for example. I had planned, which I I don't like planning stuff, but I had planned, you know, to have my morning go a certain way would lead me up to going to gym and the gym is my really end goal is to like get to the gym and actually have a good workout session today since I've been uh, at work uh, the majority of the week and when I say I didn't get to do nothing that I wanted to do yet like leading up to the gym moments I haven't got to do any of that stuff that I planned <laughs> But I'm headed to the gym right now. And that's me getting the job done. Like, it don't really matter, like, if I got to do all of the other stuff. You know, my main goal was to go to the gym and work out. So, I mean, I guess it's just more of a metaphor for, like, you know, when things ain't going your way, you just keep going your way. You know what I'm saying? Because, uh,. One thing I learned about the universe, man, is that uh, it's supposed to be hard. It's supposed to be difficult. Um, well, I'm not gonna say it's supposed to be, but it as it's it is as hard or as as difficult as you make it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, there is one ground law I feel like about the universe that like you're gonna go through something before you get what you want. You know it's all about like how you handle that something or how do you let that something affect you you know what i'm saying are you gonna let that something stop you from completing your goal completely you know are you gonna let that something like hold you back from doing it for a long time or like are you gonna like you know face that something head on knowing that you have to go through some work before you get to where you're going. Like, it's more of just a mindset thing. Like when you know you gotta go through some BS before you can get to the light at the end of the tunnel. It's like that darkness in the tunnel is the BS. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like people always say, you know, you see the light at the end of the tunnel. It's like the same thing. Like, you know, stay positive because you know you're gonna get to where you're going. Like, and when you get there, it's gonna be great. So, like I said, it's more of a just like, it's more of a mindset thing, like knowing the fact that you're going to have to deal with BS or certain things that you may not like. Knowing the fact that reaching your goal will not be 100% easy. You, you're going to have some type of pushback. I mean, this is just how, you know, the universe works. Um, and I think you can flow through it better just surrendering and not giving it that negative emotion when things don't go your way like just continue to do because you know that it's going to work out yeah i mean it sounds real like simple to me like when i say it but it may be a a, a difficult concept to uh grasp because i mean if you're goddamn getting whooped over your head with a bat <laughs> well that might be it for you i don't <laughs> that might be a little too extreme because i don't know what you're doing i don't know what you did to cause you to just be getting whooped over here with a bat but i'm saying though like Eventually, they'll stop whooping your ass. <laughs> oh, my 
my god, bro. Let me find a better metaphor. Okay, like. Let's just say it's something that you want to buy, right? And you got bills, you got responsibilities. And this thing that you want is it's a it's not a necessity. It's like it's just something that you want. So you save for it. Knowing that you have bills and responsibilities to pay for that usually takes the majority of your bread, you save for it and you go and get it. It's like you don't become depressed because it's like, oh, I don't have $6,000 right now. I can't really buy this thing that I really want. Like I got everything else I need, but I just don't have $6,000 to buy this thing that I really, really want. And it could be beneficial to my life. You know, you, some people may look at it and say, oh man, I can never afford that. It's just way too expensive. And they never get what they want. And some people, they're gonna say, okay, let me look at this thing. I got this amount of expenses and I got this amount of extra money left over. I can save this amount for X amount of days and I'm gonna have that $6,000 product. It's just all about a mindset, man. It's really a mindset. And I hope y'all follow me and y'all get what I'm saying because I feel like I was just rambling a little bit there in the middle, like trying to look for a metaphor. But it's like, it's pretty easy to understand if you have responsibilities in your life, if you are already that type of person that take care of, uh, you know, bills and whatnot. I don't know, it was just something that came across my mind. It's like, you know, stay positive, man. Um, every step of your plan, not every step of your plan is going to go exactly how you planned it. You know what I'm saying? But if you keep focused on the end goal and knowing that, you know, God got you and you will get there eventually. Um, it's just all about the mindset. You know what I'm saying? You dig? do all the crying in the world man i mean it's not going to really help you you get what i'm saying so it's better to just have a chill and understanding approach to everything in life try to understand why it is things are happening why is things happening this way you know uh understand your role in your own happiness like understand that you play a big role in your own happiness like don't go out in the world looking for things to make you happy. That starts at home. That starts with yourself. That starts when you wake up and you look in the mirror, you know, and you tell yourself, man, you handsome today, man. You just looking good, man. God really blessed you with an amazing vessel. You know what I'm saying? And you, you take that mentality and you go forward with it. You live your life. Yeah, man. But, um... That's all I got for today. I just pulled up to the gym. I'm going to get my swole on and see what else the universe got for me today. So, as usual, like I be saying, these videos ain't for nobody, honestly. It's like just for me, my own personal archive, just to go back. I mean, it is in the public domain, so anybody can see it. So, I mean, if you do stumble across this page, I hope and pray that you are able to take something positive from it with, I mean, if anything, something positive and um, something that you can apply to your life and maybe help you for the better, you know, something like that. Deuces.